Table Podcast with Mponoko. Today is a very interesting topic as we're going to be engaging on the that guy is which is an inmate in Huon Ward Prison. Apparently, the video, his videos have been socializing and circulating. Babang and then he's been saying like he eats well, stays well, doesn't pay rent. Like yo, he gets breakfast, lunch, supper. Yo, even education free. Like, what do you have to lose in prison? So today's gonna be the topic. We are sponsored by Mahwantula Herbal Medicine, and I'm not alone in the studio. I'm with Ndatechis. Please introduce yourself to that camera. No, oh, uh, thanks uh, very much, Mponoko, and for interviewing us uh, regarding the issue. Yeah, you are raising. Thank you very much. And uh, okay, can you introduce yourself, my lady? <laughs> I'm Zanzi Voice. My name is Zibongi Le. Zibongi Le Kalo. Well known as Bongi though. Thank Bongi. You. Okay, in the studio we have cheese and then we also have Bongi in the studio. So guys, uh, the video has been circulating and it has been trending, guys. So what I want to know from your views, guys, do you think um, the judiciary uh, system on South Africa compared to the judiciary system in the other, other countries, is this familiar? Like, are they strict? Do you think like they are careless in terms of what happened with that guy inmate inside the, the by the prison, Mr. Cheese? No, thanks, um, for, uh, I think uh, the judiciary is not doing well. But uh, first of all, uh, I can start uh, with uh, the way uh, our government system is working uh, regarding the issue of the foreign nationals. Because if you can see the gentleman that is feeling uh, at, home at home in the prison, <laughs> yeah. and it's clear that uh, some of us inside, uh, outside, we are paying... Uh, He's feeling everything and he's got uh, in um, breakfast, he's got uh, in lunch. lunch, he's got a uh, dinner. So uh, it's very sad to South Africans uh, regarding uh, the, the, the issue of this uh, foreign national guy. So probably maybe you had friends that have been in prison before when I uh, Do you think or, uh, other prisons, the way that guy's treatment is there by Hunwood uh, prison, is not the same as Sun City, it's not the same as Locop, it's not the same as CMEX and other prisons? No, I can maybe say um, for, uh, to other prison, yeah, it's not the same like this guy. Yeah. This guy is there that is feeling home, and I can say maybe uh, some of uh, maybe some of the warden, they are part of that guy again. Remember, uh, there's a lot is happening in South Africa regarding our prisons, but if you can check uh, maybe your likes like uh, Polsmo and you never uh, find this situation because uh, day in out and day out uh, it's a uh, uh, the war game game war in the in the prison so that's why uh, we feel surprised about uh, this uh, video trending of this guy as a south africans hmm. Spongile, tell us as you have been following this uh, tiktok videos of um, what is his name Bonface Banks Mamita Bonface Banks uh, have you have uh, been following this guy in TikTok? You've been like circulating, going back to see who that money, how long has he been in prison, and everything. And he's been having an excess of a cell phone inside of the prison. So when about Lauren, like, what do you think? What's your take on that? Well, for me, it's it's a bit sensitive. Mm. I feel a bit sensitive. Why? Because uh, when we talk, um, when we listen to what the young man is saying mm. or the the inmate is saying, Ibuaka ntotenga tate honama South Africans kifilang kesa hono hubeya matoro na hoto. Remember when you're talking about how you get in lunch, dinner, and supper. Yeah. Hona le bato, not by kids ang horbaski ba banana lito na ntote. Haba na zona. Yeah. And then how buaka hore hona le ntota hosapa. There's a lot of us, especially the young people. Mm. They are not working to start with. They are not going to schools, I guess. And then again, when we talk load shedding, we're mm. talking the campaign is at the Remember that. And then remember uh, load shedding has become a main source. Mm. And then here we are talking uh, there's drugs, there's 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 Amapara, they call them like that. Amapara. They 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 called they're called by the likes of saying um Kibonya mm. did our government ever sit down and thought to themselves, okay, 
And then the South Africans. problematic drugs out there. What does it say to you as the government regarding that matter? And then as community, okay, fine. Here's this person. Remember, they're getting shoes, mm. they're getting uniform, mm. they're getting uh, shelter, they're mm. getting uh, toiletries, mm. Education. they have beds. Yeah. They like, and then when you don't even have those. Cheesy. You are, you are like. Kore, you are deprived mm. from education. Mm. You, you. There's no, there's no jobs. Mm. What do you say as a South African? So rephrase Wangila from the latest video of that guy when he says. Hatala video like says haters. Mm -hmm. So when not do you, who do you think the haters are being referred to that guy? Okay, going back, if Kere haters, mm. if if I could relate to the word haters, haters. Mm. I'm gonna say South Africans. Yes. Remember there was like um something that was called xenophobia. Yeah. So who's the hater there? South Africans. So as a South African, he's in the South African prison, yeah. and then he's Enjoying shouting the out saying, okay, haters. Hate us. Yeah, so, yeah. Yena, he's, he's from another country, country yeah, which is Zimbabwe. and then Ore hate us. Yeah. And then remember, how are the haters? Remember, there's xenophobia attacks. attacks yeah. How work are xenophobia attacks? Meaning, they thought it was hatred towards them. Yeah. So, haters are us. Uh, South Africans. Yes. So, Shizi, this guy has been detained and being detained in prison it was for the uh, apparently they said it's allegations of assault they didn't even specify what assault is that so this guy is from zimbabwe ne? so what we want to know is that if you are arrested as an immigrant they first gonna hold you to the old and then take you to Lindela like, and then be deported so what do you want to know is that, do you think, uh, if a foreigner commits a certain crime, like this guy, uh, according to the law, is it like lawful for him or her to be sentenced in South Africa while the, the immigrant is from Zimbabwe? No, thanks and mm. I think, uh, firstly, I can say, uh, not only the correctional, yeah. even the subs and the sacks, they are not doing it. Yeah. Remember, if someone is being detained, mm. it's a job of the SARS and the SARS to make sure that they consult with the authorities of the Zimbabweans. Mm. So that again, when the, uh, the, the prosecution is still ongoing on the uh, court of law, mm. there is a again, communication between the authorities on uh, both sides. So it seems uh, the SARS, even the SARS, mm. they didn't do their work. Yeah. So that guy, even again, when we return back, we can say again, uh, remember the Section 35 yeah. of, co of Constitution. Yeah. It defends again that guy because it says clear that uh, that guy must uh, treat fair and fair uh, square uh, in his trial. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah, he deserved that. Yes. So you see uh, our our law. Yeah. I think uh, the GNU, yeah. there's a lot must be done. There's uh, a lot must be done. Yeah, to them. And as the minister... Uh, the newly appointed minister of uh, correction, Mr. Peter, Peter uh, Kronewald. Kronewald, yeah. they must make sure that um, although we are crying about the uh, corruption outside with the taxpayers money, now you see this man is claiming um, uh, the home with the taxpayers uh, uh, money in the jail. Yeah. So I think there's a lot that must be done in the GNU uh, government. Hmm. Uh, according uh, to this uh, video that uh, all South Africans, Babu uh, Agayona. Yeah, and uh, it's very sad to South Africans. Yes, as Boingi said, or Honale Mutomung Aroba Langasaja, Mutu Oja Takasapa and Tina. I can't. Yes. So I think, and uh, that's why our crime with Bohemishners, it, it will never when, drop. It will never drop. Because yeah. of that, guys, they feel at home when uh, they are in jail. Yeah. I think uh, it's a statement I can say uh, to you. Okay, so Bongi, according to uh, some tabloids that I read today, they say, uh, according to Action SA, they say, uh, wow, uh, prison, prison, prisons in South Africa are now 
uh, escalated to be regarded as hotels. So what would, you, would you be your intake in that? Well, um... Hmm. <laughs> hotels. <laughs> You're not a prison anymore. <laughs> What's it like? This thing, I can't even laugh about it. Yeah. The seriousness of it. Yeah. I can't even shy away and say, you know, I'm just going to pretend. Hmm. Fine. You know, South Africa, like, yeah, I saw on one of your posts yeah. where you've written that uh, South Africa is a film. Yes. Yes, it is a film. It's a movie. Yeah. Actually, an episode. An episode, yeah. Yeah. Because <laughs> now, um, when you look at yeah. these things, firstly, it was Tabo Besta. Yeah. Now we're looking at this. Mm. And then, um, during the course of all the videos, you're going to find out, Uguti, okay, fine, I'm a TikToker though. Mm. And I've seen a whole TikTok of LA. There are some other inmates by Zang live on TikTok. Mm. I understand. So, as it is, Okay, fine. Because these people yes. but then the technology is bringing them close to us. Then moto oh we to die in every day. Remember, no um it was said who didn't again the presence are on said the rehabilitation centers. That word. Kiona give regarded as that. So then how are you in rehab if you're gonna brag about the behavior? Yeah, rehab. And the other thing, she's uh, let's and Renas Bongile, let's take it as if that inmate was a South African. Preggy. You understand? It would pinpoint also to the government as well to say, oh, this that's why the the, the higher the crime it is in South Africa. So now is it diverted because it has happened from a Zimbabwe in a foreign. I get now we're asking ourselves away, the smartphone, with, how did it get into the prison? The data he uses, the, the, the social media platforms he gets. And do we ask ourselves a question, guys, already? Was there any wardens busy around checking everything? Do they have raids and everything in that certain prison? Well, Abdimpo, can I make it clear now? Yeah. Uh, statement is Agassiz, I'm a TikToker. Yeah. I'm a TikTok. I like TikTok. Yeah. And I'm not saying only foreign nationals, Kapo, but ba 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 plekeze di irgatlaso. But we can't show our horror. We are not a South Africa. We do have our inmates. I understand. But ba ba in saying most horrible murders you can even think of. And yet again, these people, but yet they murder them. Baba, how are you gonna feel? Okay, fine. Uh, you are not guilty until Still proven, proven guilt. Exactly. Mm. And then, how could that happen? How do know we enter a huge murder? But we are that sentence. And then now, when we are defender, we are protecting you within the institution for a for community. Exactly. So, I are committing horrible murder. Le are a defender. Why I defend Anka for ah and to him? What's the word? Ah, innocent. I I be in the institution. Yeah. While one I am saying he. Exactly free. So guys, do you think or the 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 the, 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 the thing in the, the the judiciary of South Africa and the correctional services and everything and they're failing us. Well, Abdimpo, can I take that one? Yeah, story? please take his body. <laughs> Abdimpo, yeah. can I be a bit out of pitch? Okay. Ne? Remember when we talk Umsholos? Yes. Remember when he he speaks? Yeah. He says, uh, 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 King, there's a Roman Dutch law. Yes. Right? Yeah. Roman Dutch law has a law in protect on one of the South Africans. Mm. Remember, it's Roman. It's Roman, yeah. If we could give the MK the chance, yeah. Kapo, live with that party or each in your constitution, Kapo, each in China, Bill of Rights. Yeah. I think South Africa would do better. You think? I think it would do better. If we could follow Roman Dutch law, a two third majority, it's a Hale, and then Rebono Hore, King, it's a million years. Because then clearly in South Africa, we don't understand these. Uh, King, Bill of Rights, we don't mm. understand them mm. because they are not talking to us. Do we even understand the constitution in South Africa? Uh, I think uh, to Bongi's statement, mm. 
Kwaban, if as South Africans, we make sure that we change. We make two set majority. We, we, we leave the differences. I think that one it will work for us because the constitution of the South Africa it was is not, it's not speaking to the innocent or it's not speaking to the, the, the guilty. Uh, 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 it speak to those who can who put those laws. Yeah. And even now in this king a GNU government, yeah. those people are part of it, and they are going to protect those laws because they put in those laws. Those laws, yeah. Uh, always will be oppressed until that it will be changed today that we take the decision that we take two third majority mm -hmm. and we change that um, uh, that constitution. constitution. I think uh, it will be uh, the best for the South Africans to change that constitution. Mm. In yeah. the best way the that best we way. know, mm. isn't it, that we're going, Pella, the laws, they, we barely understand them mm. as South Africans. I'm not talking only for myself. Mm. We don't understand them. So should they change? Let's be open for change. Let's not fear change as South Africans. Let's be open. Like now, we're giving the GNU uh, benefit of a doubt and letting it happen. Mm. And then, Kamunana, why can't we open up for other changes? What is it out there for us? Why do we always have to say, ah, party, why can't we open up? Isn't it that they, English says you only learn from your mistakes? Yes. So without mistakes, are you going to learn? No, no, you're not going to learn. So, Skahari Pile, GNU, chance. Let's give a uh, two third majority chance. So, what's going to happen, guys, if um, this case that is okayed now with uh, this guy, a uh, bond face, if his case will suddenly like fade away? Ne? Because you know how South Africa is, guys. We've had cases, um, the trial has been going, she's no ending. We've had other trials, we've had other trials, we've had Tabo Besta now. And they, it's all, Tabo Besta also, you guys saw, it's also like living lavish in there. Like if it doesn't he could actually, in there. like that thing, like how it's, it's, it's I get it, the guy was the bad one. Mm. Now we're speaking. I know Tawabest. Not all of us were speaking. Yeah. Remember Tawabest could like, I had sent to the Facebook, I should tell him, the presentation started yeah. in prison. Yeah. Nobody said anything about that. Mm. So how is it any different from ill? Let's not look at who is doing what. Let's look at the problem is along and come up with a solution. So we're hoping for the GNU to come up with something better for us guys and that's to see the change anything no. to save south africa anything to save south africa no <laughs> but in, for on my side i can say uh, to GNU, i see uh, the long walk to freedom yeah yeah because uh, i think uh, that marriage uh, it, it will never last yeah as i'm saying there are those who protect uh, those uh, roman dash law mm. and there are those who are against it There's those laws so that marriage will never last and if I can go back to your, uh, your, your question, mm. uh, it's not only uh, the Zimbabwean, the Tabo Besta, how many ministers mm. who have been charged with the corruption, where are they now in, uh, with their cases? Exactly. Because if uh, we can check, we can say Ronald the South Africans, and someone goes free in South Africa. Mm. So, but I think there's a long walk to freedom to this uh, GNU. Mm. But if you can allow ourselves and to say we, might, we want change for two third majority, yeah. I think uh, we, we can see we can that go change. Somewhere. We can go somewhere. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Yeah, I'm Zanzi Voice, guys. You are hearing it. The discussion is getting hotter and hotter. What she said, they have to I No, okay, there was another one. There was another thing, that, thing, guys, that which is very important. There was a list. It, it will be from the Department of Sports and Art and Culture under the Ministry of Gates and McKenzie. Yeah, uh, approximately around 72 million it will to the artists, the athletes and everything. And most of the veterans and everyone, they didn't get that on the list. So, look at it.